these trucks are notorious for not having very good airflow for trying to put bigger motors or bigger radiators in them as you can see it's pretty well blocked off so we're going to work on getting that opened up a little bit now this doghouse had been modified 20 years ago when i first built the truck it looked a lot different in here than it does now and i modified it to fit that 4.3 v6 before so it's already got a lot of modifications done which will still work for this truck but we're going to raise all of this area here up all this is going to come about four inches and we're going to take and remove this old heater panel here or heater block off panel i should say and there's just a few bolts and this just comes off so that saves a little bit of time right there then we're going to cut this back here and do some more sheet metal work here to, to create more airflow Okay, there's what it looks like with some cardboard aided design. I think we just about got it. Starting from the cardboard template. To the finished part, all ready to be put into the truck. Okay, let's see how this thing is going to fit. adding a few self-drilling sheet metal screws to temporarily hold it in place while I tack everything and weld everything in place. Okay, we got all that body work all done. As you can see, there's a whole lot more room there for airflow. We got these all rounded over here going in. So the airflow is around that. We've bent this in here, get more airflow there. And the same with here, we've got more airflow. So it'll go right around here. So when, eventually when we have the radiator in there, it'll have a lot better cooling. <laughs> If you'd like to see more of this build and to see other videos that we have, make sure to click that like and subscribe button down below.